Hey guys, so I'm back with another mukbang. Today I made me some um, Parmesan crusted Tuscan chicken pasta. Mouthful. Um, I'm really excited, I'm really hungry. I've waited really late um, to cook. Um, not purposely, but it's really late. So I'm just ready to dig in. Um, so yeah. Let's just, let's just dig in. It's so creamy, like, ugh. Ralph has been salivating, just waiting to bite into this. And then, I told you guys before that, like, I normally will, um, cook for my husband. Um, well, uh, make his plate first. So, like, I end up watching him eat first, and it just makes me, like, ugh. Ralph is literally salivating, thinking about it. It makes me very hungry, but first bite. Mm. Mm. Very creamy, very cheesy. Mmm. Mmm. The perfect Parmesan crust. And then I use chicken thighs. Chicken thighs are just more moist. Ew, I hate the word. But they're juicier to me. Mmm. Oh my god. So good. Creamy. Mm. That's so good. If you haven't had Tuscan pasta before, the spinach in here, spinach in here, there's tomatoes in here, um, Italian seasoning. Italian blend cheese, also Parmesan cheese. And then some different seasonings. Heavy whipping cream. Really good. Have water on the side.
Mm. And second, amazing. I'm really proud of the chicken. Honestly, if it wasn't for TikTok, because I've made this before, just the chicken was different. If it wasn't for TikTok, I literally just would have like um, cooked the uh, sauteed like the chicken. Would have cut it up and just like cooked it in like some butter and seasoning. <clears throat> but I was scrolling through um, TikTok. Whenever I have a taste for something, I always go to TikTok to look up like just different recipes because and not that I don't know how to cook certain things such as like I want to do a spin on certain things like if it's something that I've cooked before and I always use the same like recipe and I'm consistent with the recipe I want to try something different if there's something different out there so I was like let me go to TikTok look up um Tuscan chicken pasta and I saw a lot of different spins on it. Well, I don't want to say a lot. I've seen a good amount of different spins on the recipe. Um, and then I saw this one and I was just like, wow. It reminded me of um, uh, Noodles and Company. When I went to Michigan. When I lived in Michigan. I used to go to News and Company a lot. And when I did, I would literally get, what was it called? The penne. Oh no, I don't remember what it's called, but it was like penne something, which was very close or similar to this pasta dish. And then on top of it, I would get the Parmesan crusted chicken. So, when I saw the recipe, I was like, okay. There's just some things I need to tweak here and there. But I can do that. And then, like I said, <clears throat> it reminded me of, um, it was in company, so. I was like, why not? Hold on. This keeps falling down. Pin it up. It's so good. It's so good. It's so fulfilling.
cherry tomatoes in a pasta dish. <clears throat> I don't know what it is, but they're so good. It's so good. Very flavorful. Mmm, I'm getting full. And this is going to be my last bite. Tomato. Oh my god, it's so good. Y'all, it's so late. I wasn't expecting to cook this late or even eat this late, but you know, things happen. But I'm not about to go to sleep right away because I'm not about to fall asleep on something heavy like this. Give myself a little bit of time. I might just hop in the bath or just take a long shower. Give myself a minute. Let it digest. Sit on the couch. Hot fire getting good. Honestly, I'll probably just go ahead and edit this video. That's what I'll do. So it's prepped and ready for you guys tomorrow, which will be today for you guys. Anyways, I'm done. I can't eat anymore. I'm not about to um, overstuff myself. Pasta, that's one thing. <sighs> I can't overindulge. Even though I'll be wanting to, I just... But anyways, I'm going to end the video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. So I had to burp. I really appreciate it. Please, please, please continue to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell down below so you know when I post new videos. And until next time, as always.